thousand. I don't know. Don't you a rapper? No, I don't rap that. Yeah, you do. Oh, okay. Yeah, you do. You do rap. Yeah. I'm gonna wrap it that fell off. Like, don't worry about it. You know, you're for the right? You're paying for You're paying for You better. Uh, Man, TJX6 has had an interesting career trajectory. So, if you guys don't remember who little TJ or who TJX6 is, not little TJ, but TJX6, basically he was the pioneer of an era about two years ago, which I know you all remember, but the scam rap era. Everybody was talking about scamming, scamming this, scamming that, and he was at the forefront of it. And you guys are probably wondering, well, what happened to TJ? Well, a, a, basically a mixture of things. One... It seemed like he kind of started just getting on bad terms with a lot of people. That was one of the things. The next thing that probably kind of didn't help his case was a bunch of videos started coming out of him basically getting bullied. You see him getting ran, running, running in the mall from like a group of teenagers that were trying to jump him. You see in a bunch of situations, someone said he got robbed, things like that. And the whole thing was TJ X Six really wasn't a wasn't like a street, you know, like a like you know a product of the streets. But he still kind of portrayed the image of a little bit of a tough guy image. You would he would have guns sometimes, things like that. Now, on top of that, what really hurt him was his Instagram ended up getting deleted. Now, I know a lot of people are like. Well, Instagram isn't really that important, but it is for a lot of rappers, especially a rapper like TJX6, because they have to portray an image. You know, if your Instagram gets deleted, you no longer can portray your image. OK, and one of the images that he would portray is that he's a scam rapper. He has all this money, this and that. He really doesn't have anywhere to, to really post his music at a certain point. So without that, you kind of get put in this weird scenario where you don't have any sort of any sort of 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 I like like any sort of like way to 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 get popping you just don't you don't but regardless of that fact little tj has kind of just been hidden he makes a new instagram it gets deleted he makes another new instagram it gets deleted and that's a big issue and i don't really know why they're deleting him at the same time if your entire image is built on scamming i'm pretty sure platforms aren't gonna want you on there okay now we hop into this whole thing that's been going on with tj x6 where it looks like he paid an escort and he did not want to pay her this man was he scammed everything he scammed his haircuts he scammed his fans he scammed random people and i guess now he's scamming escorts now i think that one is he broke is tjx6 broke i don't think so i mean he signed for a million dollars i know like everyone's like oh he's right like he's definitely falling off but do i think he's broke not really he probably has some money do i think that something else happened for him not to pay her probably do i think that he just has no money and he just won't pay her i don't think that's the case but i think this is one thing that also adds to the idea that some people have this idea that rappers and famous people and rich people don't pay for for escorts but that is a because you because you know like in people's heads they think that they don't have to pay for escorts but in reality you have like most people pay for ex escorts like that is what it is because you're paying for you got to think somebody like lebron for example like lebron james okay lebron james is somebody who's constantly traveling he's a multi-millionaire he probably pays for escorts now you guys are probably like well if he pays for if these people are paying for escorts how does it never come out because for the most part escorts are so used because escorts provide anonymity and amenity uh you guys know what word I'm trying to use, but they basically provide some sort of blanket of security because an escort isn't a good escort if everybody knows that they're an escort. Most escorts, for the most part, you guys will never know exist because they get paid for their silence. You just have sex with them and you keep it pushing. OK, now little TJ's in this weird predicament to where I don't really like. Like, you know, like, look at Batman Kevin. This man said he paid, like, 15, 15 grand for sex, okay? Now, if you guys think that somebody like TJX6 isn't going to be there, then I think that, you know, it would be a little delusional. Do I think that TJX6 should be paying at his for, for, for sex at this point of his career? I don't think so at all. I think that this man, if anything, he needs to start releasing music and probably try making another comeback to Instagram. It's just very difficult when you're at a position like him because even you look up, you know, TJ x6 you know you just look him up on youtube i don't even think he's dropping music yeah the last time he dropped like music is a, a music video was a year ago so 
I think it's some something has to be going on with his label to where he's just not able to to really make music because he hasn't been dropping music either. It isn't like it isn't really like TJ is it, like like I'm looking like it's not like he's just dropping music. He's just not really he's just not really drop like it isn't like he's just not dropping music. And on top of that, he doesn't have an Instagram, so he's kind of just dropped off the face of the earth. Now, could that be for legal reasons? I don't know. I'm not really gonna speculate on that. But my whole point is that I think that somebody like TJX6 probably needs to get their career back on track by just dropping music for some reason every artist thinks that they're like playboy cardi little uzi like they have these strong fan bases where they can just never drop music but in reality we're in a consumer's era just flood the streets we look at nba young boy he feeds his fans you look at real the young og and all the dallas flint rappers i mean not dallas michigan flint rappers they all feed the streets and that's what little tj not little tj i keep calling little tj because i haven't said tjx6 in so long but that's exactly what tjx6 needs to do to get his career back on track but what do you guys think do you guys think that maybe he he just is broken he just had to pay for this escrow i need your guys opinion remember give me a like comment subscribe it's your boy peace